We're back. Let me go ahead and hit spacebar again just to make sure everything's calculated. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I just I just had to notice all of this all of this stuff up here was dead. And I was like, no, hold on a second. Uh, so yesterday when we left off, we had you got this enroaching uh, um, uh, heat issue coming from the bottom. So last night, the honking car is, car is gone. Uh, the honking car just left. So I don't know what the story is with the honking car, unfortunately. It's just gone. Um, but last night I did a couple tests. Uh, and it was like a 650 cycle test where I built. So first I was looking up, somebody mentioned yesterday SPOM. And I know I've heard that before, but I wasn't sure exactly what it was. Because there's so many acronyms, AETN, SPOM, and all this other stuff uh, with Oxygen not included that I just didn't, didn't like, you know, I didn't know what it was. Uh, and so I, um, uh, you know, I Googled it and I came up with this uh, couple, uh, couple threads. And one of them, I was, and one of them was purple. So I clearly have, have seen it before. I just never built whatever it was. Um, and so what a spam is is a uh, self-powered oxygen machine or something. Uh, and all and all it does. Oh yeah, I'll add that thing in a second. Um, all it does is chat only boop, and then get that back up boop. Go do this. There we go. Now we can click away and not have to worry about it disappearing. Uh, all all it does is uh, basically it's a it's a it's a it's a, uh, a self powered system that just basically makes cold air and that's it. Uh, who's that? Victor. Victor. Two years. Thank you so much, Victor, for the two years. Twenty four months. I appreciate that. Um, and so I. I realized I was like, well, I don't need to build a spawn because I have an electrolyzer that's piped. And, you know, part of that system is to rely on a regular electrolyzer to work in a whole bunch of pumps. Well, I don't necessarily need to do that. I could just use a pipe electrolyzer. So I just, so instead of building what they had, I decided to just build something that, because I understood the concept of how it works, but I needed, I just, I said, fuck, I'll just build my own and then just see, you know, what happens um, after like so many cycles. If it, if it is actually uh, not necessarily self-sustainable because it still needs power, like it's not self-powered, um, but is it something that I can uh, easily implement into this setup. So, uh, today, we are going to be implementing it into this setup. <laughs> We're going to be putting in a, uh, this, this kind of a specialized, uh, air cooling system that's going to require four Wheeze warts. Oh, hey, Preston, Mike, gonna go watch yesterday, Mike. <laughs> All right, folks. <laughs> go, go let yesterday me know that, uh, that I, that, I, that that I figure some shit out uh, tonight <laughs> for him tonight. <laughs> what are we gonna shovel to tomorrow? Tomorrow, Mike. Today, <laughs> you know that that whole like tomorrow me thing. That's something that I've always like. I've always done that. Just like it's like oh tomorrow me is fine, and then like tomorrow me comes around. It's kind of like motherfucking yesterday me. <sighs> All right, so let me let me turn this off. I don't want to be bothered. Boop. Don't bug me. Ba blam. And now, for the continuation, we're going to have to put this thing somewhere. I don't know exactly where. Uh, I'm thinking maybe over here and move some of this stuff out of the way. Uh, it's not a very large system. It doesn't put out a lot of heat once it's insulated. It actually puts out basically no heat because, um, or no heat base, no heat leaks because it is uh, sealed off with the, with the insulated tile. Um, I'm thinking actually maybe down here might be the best bet because we already have you know, so many things to temp shift plates and all that stuff that might actually help accelerate and make this work a little bit better. Um, so I think, yeah, maybe down here might be a good idea, but again, we need to have the, um, <laughs> we need to have four Wii warts dedicated to this. And so now I have the question, okay, do I, do I use the Wii warts that are currently doing a stellar job keeping our food supply coming? Uh, or, like, except for this one, this one could go. Uh, <laughs> or, do I come over here and start just basically pillaging? If I start pillaging this over here, I can still seal it off and it will it will keep itself pretty cold for a good long while. Like, one, two, three, right? We could basically cut through here, cut this door here, go through here, da 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 build a ladder, go all the way up, maybe the side right here. And then grab this and then come back uh, and then seal it back up and it should just be fine. Uh, we'll just end up cutting through a whole lot of, uh, of stuff here. Actually, let me go and map it out. Um, and then let's go to high here. And then, uh, uh. And then how are we going to do this? We'll go... It's this, uh, this polluted ice. Oh boy, that's going to be fun to work with. I think it can just keep on going like this and they'll be able to crawl up slowly. And then over here, we'll just go boom boom. Try to minimize the amount of damage that we do. 
then we'll go up here to not there. Like right about here. And then one, we'll and then we get that. Okay, so that'll be a, that's how we could grab all three of these, or all yeah, all three of these, and bring them back without with basically doing minimal amount of uh, damage. Uh, what are the seeds on the ground? Uh, sleet wheat, sleet wheat. They need a, like an ice cold uh, setting, obviously, uh, in order to grow. It actually, might be uh, yeah. There's already sleet wheat here, so that's just sleet wheat grain. Ninety. So we'll probably collect all that up too. Um, the pressure in here is low enough where it's not going to really like just push its way into this area. But if, even, if it, even if it did, I don't really care. I mean, having uh, hydrogen pushed into a cold biome is actually going to be beneficial to us in the long run. So it's not that big of a deal. Uh, let's go ahead and actually, let's go ahead and start this because I do want these pieces, uh, these wheeze warts. They're not going to do anything for us here for hundreds of cycles. So I'll go ahead and get rid of them. Um, let me see. So we'll uproot this. We'll uproot this. And we will uproot this. And then, uh, that's gonna take it forever to get to because it's, uh, door's locked there. Now they'll be able to get to it. I, I locked that door because of this, the water that's, uh, supposed to be, uh, creeping out and dripping over here. But I realized we could just open that door and it'll just pour out and over here and be fine. Um, Global War Warming Simulator. Yeah. The ranching we put on hold, uh, for watching interesting experiments fail. Well, this experiment, the experiment that I did did not fail, actually. It was a massive success. Uh, it's, it's the... How do I, or where do I put this thing that makes the most sense? Um, and you know what? In here, in here would work. In here would totally work. But I could also put it out here and it would probably work just fine as well. Uh, let's see. We do have a lot of uh, hydrogen over here that we could take and just pump in. I need a little bit of hydrogen for the room. Um, if I open up this door to get in here, ugh. I'm going to let all that oxygen out. And I've already done my best. I've done my best to get that oxygen the fuck out of here. Uh, this is all like a vacuum. Oh, that's just water or something like that taking up space. Um, let me see. That's all separating. There's a lot of salt water down here still. So, yeah. Yay. Uh, the metal from the cold biome, I think, is good at conducting heat. Well, I'm not necessarily worried about the cold biome. Just, um, uh, yeah, well, this granite's nice and cold. Should I just take that and store it? But no, this is perfect. This is exactly what I want to do. I want to get in there. Get them to to do all this, steal all this stuff, basically loot, loot and pillage, and then get out of here. So there we go. Uh, so we've already got some. Wolf inside, young blood. On Game Pass. Go get it. I'm gonna put this thing. Okay, I have to decide where I want to put this thing. I think I think maybe just right here might be good. This is a this is a warm area already, but we're gonna cool it pretty quickly. Uh, should I? What is this made out of? Dirt, dirt temp shift plates. Hmm, so efficient. <laughs> should I? God damn. It's relocated. Yeah. Uh, Solely master. Yeah, oxygen included. Basically, a uh, uh, habitat management, city builder kind of thing. Imagine Fallout, what is it? Fallout Shelter, but like, for people with brains. Kind of like that. Uh, they're getting there, they're getting there. Come on, go, go, go. Granite, oh, I made, I made the damn ladders out of granite. Whatever, I have a fucking ton of it. <laughs> Space Ant Farm, there we go. Space Ant Farm, that's pretty good. So the stuff that I need, this oxygen is going to come pouring out to open this up. I'm like heavily debating where to put this damn thing because I know I could survive in here easily. Um, and this would be nice because it would keep it, you know, just kind of silent away from everything else. And just, it's an extra space that we're not using. The problem is I don't want to deal with that air. I don't want the oxygen to get out. Uh, then I have to deal with that. But maybe I should just bite the bullet and just go ahead and do it. Just let this thing take it. I mean, there's so much little, so little oxygen down there. Let's just go ahead and do it. Fuck, let's just go ahead and do it. And then we got to start planning this. So... Uh, actually, before I, before I break that, I'll actually go ahead and start pre-planning this area. So we're going to need, how do I get the, uh, oh, how am I going to get the oxygen out? There's something, oh, I'll use a door. Yeah, I can use a door. Oh, this is going to be an interesting setup. Hmm. First is build the floor. Uh, open it from the right bottom where the CO2 is. They do have, they do, uh... You know, they do have their suits. Oh, the water will come pouring out. That'll be a pain in the dick, too. I could move the I can move the doors up, I guess. 
Now nah, I'll just break it's fine. I'll just break this and just this the oxygen gets out. I'll just it just take a few cycles to get rid of it. But I mean the amount of cold air we're gonna be pushing out of this thing is gonna totally negate any amount of whatever mistakes that I make right now. Um at least according to my experiments. So let me see. Uh so I made this thing out of igneous rock in the test. Cool, so that's what we'll do. Uh put it should put it just right over this thing. And we'll float it. We'll float it a little bit as soon as I get my mouse back. I have the asynchronous save on so that stalls shouldn't be quite as long whenever auto saves. Uh, it's not asynchronous save, it's like some other save thing that somebody built. Uh, I don't know... I mean, it works, that's all that really matters, I guess. Like, like that was a super short uh, stall there. Oh, actually, you know what, there's something I do have to do. Uh, I have to get our big picture. Big picture. Whoop. So we'll do this for like a cycle or two. My last colony has recently died horribly. Uh, how do you how do you get to like an actual end for uh, a colony? Like I feel like you could just keep going, really, right? And then eventually just uh, just give up, right? Like after so many so many errors, so many mistakes, you're just like, you know what? Just fuck it. <laughs> just give up. Um, should I make the room smaller? No, it should be bigger. We'll use the flower pot plants. Flower flower plants thing pots flower box planter box oh, that was close uh it's gotta be tall enough to also support so let's see Number one two three i wonder if i should try just three because then i could set up more than one a little more easily let me try just three so what we'll do so just three and how did I have this set up? So I had a electrolyzer. Can't run the electrolyzer out here in this heat. What can I make it out of that's not gonna make it burst? I could sit it somewhere else too. Let me see. Uh, piped electrolyzer. What can I make it out of that'll make it last? Gold amalgam. Okay, we'll set this up in here. If, oh, you know what? Oh, the pressure. Damn it. Okay, so we can't set it up in here. Uh, we can't set up this part in here. I'll have to uh, set this up over here probably with this guy and then um, or maybe somewhere else, but basically somewhere that has more room to uh, actually push out the uh, uh, the whatever excess pressure that we get because of the um, hydrogen that it generates. Or I could just leave it in here, suck this room out completely and um, and then just let it fill with hydrogen and then just start cycling that hydrogen to other parts of the base. That might be an idea. It's gonna run hot though, that's for sure. Like it's gonna be, this is gonna be a hot build. Um, I do think though, it might be a good idea. No, no, never mind. I was gonna say maybe open this up and then put it in there, but no, never mind. that's not gonna work. Okay, so we're gonna make some adjustments to this as we go. Oh, whoops, uh, I think the cold biome thing is done. Do they get it all? Okay, let's go ahead and make it, make them get this. And this, and you know what, just get everything. If, this, if, it, if it's sweepable, pick it up. Can't get that. So, oh, that's not what I wanted. And then, yeah. What is this? No storage unavailable for polluted ice. Oh, that's fine. I'm not gonna pick that up. Cool. I'll have to come back and get that stuff and then we'll seal this off. Pipe electrolyzer. Okay, so we'll put this here. We do have to drain this room, so we're gonna have to put something in here in order to start sucking it up. So maybe we'll go ahead and actually start that process now. We'll put it at the bottom, so we'll get rid of all of the... We'll just have it just basically pump gas out and into into this uh, uh, cavern here and just let it just fall and then just let it deal with it. Um, or we can actually pump it straight out. I mean, it's, it's, it's air. There's a lot of air here, but we could just pipe it into this and just say, see ya, right? Like, who cares? We can always generate more air. <laughs> that's that's a statement that's gonna come back and bite me later. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's let's see. Ventilation. Oh, that that was still fairly long. Uh, pause, but maybe it was not quite as long as it used to be. I don't know anymore. Uh, yeah, what's that right here? And then can they make that jump? Not really. We need more air. We get air. Exactly. Exactly. It's <laughs> it's gonna happen. It's totally gonna happen. Tomorrow Mike, that's right. See, you guys get it. You guys get it. <laughs> Tomorrow Mike will do that. Um, we don't need that much power coming here, so we use regular wires. We'll just go and attach some of these things. So boom, boom, boom. Uh, and we'll go straight up into this guy. And then we'll go ahead and run the pipes. Let me see. First, we're going to seal off this room. Oh, no, no. We have to, we have to try to vacuum suck this room first. 
before we do anything, we have to try to suck all the crap out of it. We're going to get rid of that. We don't need that anymore. Uh, we probably should go ahead and we mop this up. No. Hmm. We should probably get some of this air. Otherwise, it's going to start. This is going to continue uh, creating polluted air, and we don't want that. So there's a lot of work we have to do in this room. Let's go ahead and actually get this thing busted. Uh, yes. Yes. And then we can start building all this stuff. Getting as long as they have room to work around here. But yeah, I think we'd probably put like a pump or something like that. So we'll go plumbing, pitcher pump. We'll put it right here. Does that work? Does that actually go down? No, it doesn't look like it. Damn. Okay, so we'll go. Uh, uh, put pitcher pump right there. One more over, and that, and then they'll just basically. I'll just have them just pump the water out of there, and then we'll go dump it somewhere else. Instead of using like a liquid pump, just probably gotta take this a few. There's a few good squirts, and then uh, we'll be able to take the rest and put it somewhere else. So yeah, we got. We should probably put a door there though too. Manual airlock. Uh, let's put a fancy airlock. Something fast. Some half mechanized, no regular airlock. There we go. What's it made out of? Made out of aluminum to core, iron ore, gold amalgam, thermally reactive, and wool for mine. Okay, well, we'll just do aluminum. And we'll attach it. We'll attach it. Uh, let's go ahead and grab this. And actually, no, you know what? We will pull it. Pull it. I don't want it. If I use regular wire, then it's going to. um probably cause issues. So we'll just go over it. Because it'll be the weakest link. Oh, they did not work. Let me see. Uh, power wires. Shoop. Power conductive. Hmm, what if I should try to avoid going in the room? Ah, it's fine. Cold is not gonna kill anything. Who's that? 7-Bit Brian! Excuse me! <laughs> <laughs> 22 watts, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, that was well time. Um, whoa, man, thank you so much for that. Appreciate it. I'm allergic to your bullshit. Uh, all right, so we got it. So we got to get this room uh, sucked dry, and you guys love that. And then we will. Let's see. We'll just take this and we'll just patch this into the. To this. Mm, yeah, just go straight into it. It's fine. This is gonna have a. Uh, we'll, we'll reuse this pipe later, but for this, this is gonna go into the room, and uh, we'll just go. Maybe we'll just go down a little bit, and then we're gonna start zigzagging in here. Basically, the whole thing is gonna be freezing cold by the time we're done, so we might as well do this, and then. Probably go over one more. No, because it's not going to be open on that side. There is actually, it is going to be open on one side. You know what? I think we will actually use. Oh, wait, am I using insulated on this? Damn. Used <laughs> to be insulated going in, but that's it though. And then uh, from there, regular gas pipe I found. You're just still mad at one time legendary I ranked Laura's hair and brownies above. <laughs> You and Gary. Yeah, that one time. <laughs> uh, you're right. You got me. Uh, let's. <laughs> I don't remember that, man. I swear to God, you guys have way better memory than I do when it comes to some of this shenanigans and bullshit from from days past. Uh, let me get out here, and then this is where it's going to connect eventually. Or actually, we'll just go... I have to have access to this whenever whenever we uh, close everything up, so... We need to make it somewhat easy to, to get to. So we'll go like this. And then we'll stop there. For the insulation, we'll go... Yeah. Oh, this actually, we'll, we won't do... And we won't do the whole thing here. Okay. Because we still need them to uh, to clean up their clean up all this crap down here. Oh, they can't get down here actually. Whoops. Oh, they still can't get down with that. Let's do this. <laughs> all right. So the pump's got. So the pump's gonna just basically take everything and eject it out into space, which is great. Um, they still need to get this. This get this get like everything in this area here done. That way the door opens and closes a little bit more more quickly. Uh, is that pipe throwing oxygen into space? Sure is. We don't need oxygen. It's very little. Like if you look, it's uh it's 90, 70 something grams. Like it's very, very little. 
Uh, so yeah, we're just we're ejecting into space right now. It's also uh, pretty warm. We will eventually come back around and probably uh, you'll seal this off and, and and use it a bit more efficiently. But right now, I just wanted to clear this room of as much oxygen as I possibly could. Finger or the palm. Finger. Or the... What? Oh my god. <laughs> um. So yeah, I need to basically create as much of a vacuum in this room as I can, which will take probably more than just one pump, but this is going to take time, period, so we might as well just get it started. Uh, this whole thing needs to be actually prioritized pretty high. They're going, but we need to get this stuff done. Done! This should get going more, more quickly than anything else, though, because I have to start pumping water out of here. So, basically what's going to happen is... Oh, and I got to put a uh, receptacle here. Oh, you have to build conveyors and all kinds of crap. Let me see. So we'll put a receptacle here. Well, actually, the receptacle can go anywhere, right? Yeah, that's right. The receptacle doesn't have to be... Oh, you know what, though? That'll block the, uh, the Wii's ward, so we'll put it right here, then. And then... Rail. So we're going to bring this rail. What is it made out of? Oof, man. Oh, God. Oh, it's so expensive. So expensive. So expensive. Will the rail automatically... Sort? No, I have to have a separate rail system to have something unique going just to this. Oh, you know what I know I'll do? I don't, I don't need all this craziness. Um, I just need somebody right on the outside. Uh, like, like, well, crap. Well, I guess I could have moved the door a little bit more farther in, which I'll probably do right now, actually. Uh, where should I put this? I know. We'll move this door in at just a smidge. I'm making that airlock, so right there. We'll make that a nine. It's right, it's right on the power line, so it should get built pretty quickly. And this, here we go. Whoops. Pitcher pump? No. They sh should. Oh, that's right. I get a bottler going. Bottler, so we can make this a little bit higher and also tell it to do polluted water. There we go. So if we raise this up to like a nine, they'll start pumping water out of here, but I don't want to do it just yet. Good. I'm so happy. So we're going to get rid of this door. Deconstruct. Auto dispenser and but yeah, auto dispenser, all kinds of stuff. You'll see. You will see. Uh, conveyor loader, and then uh, yes, yeah, so conveyor loader. We'll put. I guess we'll just use dupe power to to distribute it. And then we'll put a just a bin right here that has uh, phosphorite. Oh, and we gotta connect it too with rails. Whoops. Shipping, conveyor rail. There we go. So this way, this room could stay sealed. We don't have to have people going in and out. This area up here, we don't necessarily need to worry about. I wonder if I should go ahead and just seal this thing across the bottom. It'll take less time to vacuum suck it. Maybe we'll wait till it gets started, and then we'll then we'll make adjustments uh, accordingly. We have to get water in here too. Plumbing. Insulated pipe. Ew, gross. Not a whole lot coming out from down here. Mostly dirty and, and probably tiny little speck. What's in this little... Hold on a sec. What's in this little gap right here? Polluted water at what? 140 grand. The tiny, tiniest little... Little dots. Look at this. It's getting all held up because of the damn mix of crap that we have here. But it's getting lower. This used to be a huge chunk of, uh, of polluted water. So we've actually gotten it pretty well taken care of. Who was it that was saying, was it, Aner, was it you? Somebody was saying that, uh, in Discord, that, um, my priorities on some of these things were incorrect. Um, and I want to say that they were correct. It was incorrect. I thought I fixed it, but apparently I did not. If I set this thing to four, uh, then it's going to start taking and shooting it up. So yeah, it was, these things were not quite high enough. Uh, when I looked down, I always saw that, um, these things were full. But what it was is the dupes were manually loading it. Uh, so it's a little misleading. Uh, so yeah, these things need to be a four. See, these ones are four right here. Oh, you can't see because my picture's blocking. Trust me, these are fours. <laughs> the one time my picture's blocking something important. Um, but yeah, those are fours. So those are... Uh, those are going to work uh, correctly. Okay, so let's get everything gone. But yeah, once I get this polluted water out of here, then at least we don't have to worry about that. That's going to be a problem. Board pen. Been a while since I've been able to catch your stream. Where you been? I haven't gone anywhere. Well, I'm glad you're here, Ben. Plain oxygen included, as you can see. 
Uh, trying out something that I built last night as a test, and I ran for 600 cycles, and it was massively successful. Way more successful than it should have been. Had no, had, it had absolutely no reason to be so, so successful. Okay, here we go. Building this machine. Can they reach this? It can. Okay, everything can be reached. That's all that matters. We could probably go and throw the Wii's warts in here now, just for fun. Warts. Boop. Copy settings. Dip, dip. Let us, some cold carbon dioxide is fine. Okay, so now that most of this stuff's built, let's go ahead and set this to a 9. And they should start running running in and out and, let's see, phosphorite for this. And pumping water and dropping it in. Let's just make this a 6, I wonder if I should put a limit on how much it can hold. Just like, just in general. How much phosphorite do I have? I have tons of it. Oh, come on. Uh, organic, organic. Where it is? Phosphorite. 9.9. .9, so I have tons. <laughs> like, actual tons. And this is only going to take phosphorite as well. Oh, and there's no power to that. Whoops. Really? It's, I thought I was sitting on a power line. Oh, my God. <laughs> it's been a while since I could watch your Twitch live stream. Woofy! Well, we do appreciate your presence. Master Wolvie. Now I have Stain. <laughs> it's been a while. <laughs> I thought that was weird how you spaced that out. But yeah, you're right. That is. <sighs> what was that? 14 Shades of Grey or something like that? The actual name. Not like the book. Uh, <laughs> which is, I think, 50 Shades. Um, that, you know, I, I loved and hated that album. Uh, because I loved the stained sound, I loved his singing, I loved, like, I mean, I thought it was such a great sound. And that album had so many good songs, but the production of it was fucking terrible. Um, if you listen to it now, it's like, it's, oh, is that Break the Cycle? Okay, yeah, so the 14 Shades of Grey one, again, I, I listened to the shit out of that, but it was so compressed that it was, like, distorted. Like, all the heavy parts was so over-compressed that it was just distortion. And I was just, I was really just like upset. It was just like, come on, man. That's like, it's just wasting all this great, you know, just sound for what? Uh, let me see. Liquid Veil, Fluid Water. So this is actually, they're not, they're not grabbing this like they should be. There's so many, <laughs> there's so many badly produced music. Yeah. Or albums. Yes, yes, yes. Let's do this because they're dumping everything in here and I want them just to focus on this. So if I do this, they might have polluted water from somewhere else that they're grabbing that's been mopped up. Well, let's give them a second to figure it out. I'd rather care that they do that work. Uh, all because one person forgot to update the certificate that would keep a database running at 2,000 plus convenience stores. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> uh. Is he fired? <laughs> it's an honest mistake. Auto bottle. Oh, auto bottle is. Uh, hold on a second. No auto bottle. So, dude was delivered bottle liquids directly to for pitcher pumps. There we go. Oh, that's what I was missing up. Dang it. Okay, so make that a nine, and then let's see. Enable auto bottle. So disable auto bottle. Enable auto. There we go. That's what I want to see. That's what I want to see. Good. Killing demon. Getting it. All I have to do is get low enough we can mop. Once we can mop, then this is not a problem anymore. I'm really stressing you out. Oh shit. Whole Foods? Or Trader Joe's? I think Whole Foods is green. Walmart Marketplace is green too, though. Or Walmart, what is it called? Neighborhood Market? That's green too. Hmm. Hmm. Ends with an 11. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it doesn't start with a 7 and end with 11? <laughs> hmm. I don't want to give away too much, but... Uh, let's go ahead and raise this up a little bit just to have them slowly work that, uh, pull that over. Come on, come on. Too much liquid. Just a couple more. Oh, 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 we're getting there. A couple more squirt, squirt. There we go. Done. Mop, 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 all day long. Mop, 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 why'd I sing this song? Gonna mop that floor, gonna make it shine, gonna... Something, something with turpentine. Where the fuck did I get that song from?
I don't know. Hmm. Oops. I need to like make that up. Like that came from somewhere and I can't remember where. <laughs> uh, let's see. How are things going in here? Oh, what is this? A directly egg. Ooh, we're gonna have two of them. In our not failed experiment with ranching. Works Walmart hates his job. You can't say I got you. Gotta quit his job. About to once again kilt. I had a new job. A kilt? It's very specific. I uh, should have gotten a job before he quit. Oh well. What's up, Vextress? Everyone's in here just talking about how we're gonna quit our jobs. <laughs> we're gonna just quit our jobs, get out of here. Get that, get that, get that. Come on, come on. Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it. There we go. Alright, so we get to save auto bottle. Let's go ahead and get rid of this pitcher pump. We do still need to have uh We'll put a couple ladders here. Boop, boop. So this is pipe blocked. Okay, because... Oh, okay. Well, it's just... I guess it just takes a lot to get shit out in space. So that's gonna go. That's not gonna mix. Let's turn off the gas pipe down here. To make life a little bit more... A little bit easier. There we go. So now we should have no issues getting this thing drained. It's already actually getting pretty low. Like, yeah, this, this room is actually emptying out pretty quickly. Good. Um... Space is full to float. Uh, outside it stopped. Sp <laughs> Space is just turning things back. It's like, no, no, no. <laughs> we're, out, we're, we're out here, guys. Uh, let me go ahead. Now this is running. This is all going. We got hydrogen here, but I got to pump hydrogen into this room. That's right. That's the other thing I got to do. I can't forget that part. So let's get the ventilation here. So we need another pipe just to drop, uh, drop hydrogen into the room. We can't put it there. Um, I could put it here and then just let me see. We gotta close. We gotta close this thing off. Like actually seal it off. So I think what we should probably do is go ahead and let's have seven, and then we'll just destroy these pipes here and we'll have it go out the top. I hope that three is enough. I really hope that three is enough for what I'm building here. I think it is, but we won't know until we you know get everything going. Boop, boop, boop. Wow, that was really fast because we're running at 10 XP. Oh, speaking of, we did not go over here and seal this off. We got to do this before, you know, shit the fan. And then we'll also do, we'll just make it a five. It's fine. Boom, boom. There we go. Did we get that sleet wheat? We did. Or that uh, wheeze warts? We did indeed. We still have, I think, another wheeze wart floating around somewhere. I heard this close. Overnight electronics, stocker, customer service, cashier, AP, sporting goods, and phone center. I have not paid enough. You're doing all that stuff? That sounds like eight different jobs. Like actual eight different jobs. <laughs> all right, so that's where we're gonna pump in the uh, uh, the gas that we need. Hydrogen is the gas that we need. Where are we gonna get this hydrogen from though? Um, I mean, we could run it from way over here. We have plenty of it. But that's a huge pain in the ass just to load up this one tiny little room. There is a way to get... There is the air thing that like puts it off into the air, right? Maybe we could do that. What is it under? Probably ventilation. Canister emptier. Okay. If we put a canister emptier somewhere nearby... We could probably get away with just pumping this thing. Oh wait, canister filler. Is there a canister emptier? No, it's all... Hmm. No, you know what? Yeah, you know what? We'll uh, we'll just put it right here and just let it just shoot out in the vicinity here. We'll cut this off. So I can tell, you know, basically we'll work until there's nothing here except for hydrogen. Then we'll cut this off and then we'll... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh wow, it's already building. Okay, that was fast. Uh, so then we'll go over here. <laughs> this is like... Overly complicated. We're gonna build. <laughs> Wait, where's another source? We have we have hydrogen up here too. You know what? Maybe we could go up here and use some of this. Oh, not a lot actually. I will. Yes, yes, and no, a lot. Okay, wow. We've managed to. We're gonna have to. This is gonna be a problem in, uh, here very shortly, but we're gonna resolve that later. That's way too much space. That's just like like volume to to work with to try to cool the base. We're gonna seal some of these areas off completely, um, temporarily completely. Um, Sixty four hundred twenty bits of camera. <laughs> Good background noise while I paint. Oh, there you go. Uh, I appreciate that. Forty shades of gray. Wikipedia has not to be confused with fifty shades of gray. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Uh, 
Let's see, canister filler. So we'll use canister filler and we'll put that. I think this floats, so we'll just go. Uh, yeah, that should work it there. And then we will run some uh, gas bridge. And that's going to go in and out right there. And then it's going to connect. And they should be able to. Oh. <laughs> Fine. All right. We'll put that somewhere a little bit further in. I thought for sure it would just float. All right. Can we, can we turn it around? Oh, we can't turn it. So we'll just do this right here. I got all. Got my hopes up. <laughs> Fort, uh, 14, whatever, 14,400 hertz. Um, try concentrate, guys. <laughs> Can't get that built. So there we go. So we'll be able to basically just bottle up uh, gas and then have them come over here and empty it out in this room. And this will be a good way of eliminating some of this excess. Is there hydrogen, hydrogen, hydrogen? Mostly hydrogen, actually, coming out of here. Good. We'll let it keep going. And then we will... Unbreathable gas. Carbon dioxide. Huh? Is this... Oh, you need can't get. Oh, okay, okay, okay. It doesn't just register whatever you have on the thing. Okay, I don't think that's this the save mod that I put in actually does anything. So, not suggested. Come on, come on, come on. Go. <laughs> My question is, does it? Ah, nice. Oh, it's. it's <laughs> It's like a, like having a barbecue, a little propane tank. All right, so now it should show up, right? Unbreathable gas, hydrogen, beautiful. Say, so enable auto bottle. I'm guessing that's gonna be bring the bottle from that side to this side to see if anybody goes for it. Somebody's going for it already. Oh no, never mind. Damn. Somebody go for it. I want to see it. It's a long trip. Uh, the bridge right uh, on the H2 pipe messes with the flow. Does it? Let me see. Oh, it does. We'll fix that in a bit. We're just doing this just to fill that room. We'll fix it later. Maybe I can actually, you know what, just to... Just to keep the peace. I think I will actually fix it now. <laughs> there we go. Easy fix. Super easy. Let's make that a nine. I should get them going. This is not, they don't have anything in here yet, so make it a, huh. No one's moved phosphorite down here yet. It's kind of interesting, but there we go. Good. We can go ahead and turn this off. Disable that. <coughs> We just need there to be a, a fair amount of hydrogen in here. That's all. Just a fair amount. And anything that doesn't doesn't get used in this build, um, we could just move. Like we could just let the let it flow out. Once we get everything sealed, then we could just basically let it flow and that's it. Uh, now this we should probably have to route to something. This is gonna be our our uh, our nice ice cold air output. So that should go. Incredible universe. For once, I am not <laughs> old enough to know what that is. <laughs> Whew, finally. <laughs> um, yeah, we're going to run this thing up. And it's going to patch into probably in this bottom pipe right here, actually. Let's go over. Uh-oh. Bad time for a save. Then we'll go up. We'll go up. And that will patch it into this whole mess. It might mess with some of this stuff, but I think it'll probably be okay. And also starting at the bottom is probably good because that's where we want the cold water to, or cold air to, to start because that bottom is uh, getting pretty pretty warm. So here we go. So good, good, good. We'll start to seal this off. We'll start to seal this off once we get enough hydrogen in here right now. There's hardly enough. Wheeze, warts, go, 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 wheeze. I'm fairly sure it has nothing to do with age and everything with you live. Oh, okay. Founded in 1992. 
how much how much is does it have per tank? Like each one, each canister. I mean, that's the contents here is 10 keys, but that's like the whole canister fill. Like, that's the whole thing. Um, oh, wait, here it is. No, that's the gas pipe. Yeah, I have to wait till they pick it up. No, that's definitely not it. It's definitely not that much. Otherwise, we'd be able to visibly see it flood that room. <laughs> it would absolutely flood that room. Okay, so this part's hooked up. Almost, almost. They can reach that. Yeah, they can reach that. Incredible units was like fries, but they put more emphasis on making the shopping experience entertaining. The, the electricity cost drove them out of business and sold only six profitable the only six profitable stores to fries. Oh, interesting, huh? Oh God, Circuit City. If it's not in the universe, it doesn't exist. <sighs> what the hell? <laughs> oh man, marketing. <laughs> Uh, we will have to block this area off here, so we'll go ahead and... I think I just paint over it. Yeah. We, sh we do need to get this, like, we do need to get some boss right in here. And I think it's all up here, and this is being stingy. Oh yeah, it is, because it's a fucking... <laughs> Alright, we'll make it a six. We'll make it a six, that way it still gets all the boss right. But... Yeah, we need some more here. Now they'll start moving things down here. And only a little bit, too. Yeah, only a little bit. And then the dupes could load up the dispenser here, and the dispenser can come down here, and the receptacle, and blah, blah, blah. And it should be like a four, I think, and these are going to be, well, those are nine, so. Good. Nice. Now if we say... If we make this an 8, and then make this a 9, then the dupes will move it from there into this. And then we should see this start to work. Right? Let's see what this surprise isn't going out of business on Lake Circuit City and Comp USA. Now they are trying to adjust instead of refusing to change. They're at least trying to adjust. What are they trying? What are they trying to do? Their stores are empty. Like, I know you guys have all seen that video, but I've been talking about it forever <laughs> because I live near a Fry's and I go there often. Uh, despite it being fucking empty, although I did buy a ton of HDMI cables there uh, this weekend uh, for like three dollars each or something. Just a bunch of like four foot cables, but I needed some like for you know, all, everything's... Because now I have everything, like, set up at once instead of, like, trading things out. So I was like, I needed HDMI cables. And so, yeah, I got, like, six of them, I think, for, like, $3 each. It's beautiful. Okay, it's not working. Uh, well, a manual use. Oh, okay, there we go. That should do it. There, and it gets loaded up in here, then this thing will load. We'll take care of all that. Beautiful. I'm excited. I think once this thing gets to, I don't know what the what we should go for, aim for, like maybe 1500 or something like that. It'll take him a while, but we'll get there. Actually, we could start, like, we could start the machine here, or run the pipe to the machine. Whoops. Uh, <laughs> and then start that. Do we have enough water going to all the systems, though? Yeah, we do. Yeah, this is all diverting over this direction. What we need is better flow through this. Like, this is probably... not gonna work for us anymore. Like, this drain system. Or maybe it will once once all of this nasty shit's out of here. Maybe that's all it takes. Just to get rid of all of that, and then, then it'll be fine. Anyways, yeah, we get water in here. That's what I meant to say. So plumbing will go to... We don't need it to be processed. Oh god, there's like nothing coming through. This thing is there not enough to do anything with. Well, we should... 
bridge here or a bridge here. This will be the first time we're going to really start taxing our water supply, actually. Because, I mean, like, we have so much. Well, never mind. We have, like, the steam thing going. Never mind. It's fine. Their sales are almost 100% online, and most of their stock are re pre order uh, order pickups. Including the assistant store manager, they lost so many people in a single day. Yeah, they like if you go to the store, there, there's a couple people that work there that I know because I go there so often. Um, and yeah, they're just like the, the previously one of the um, uh, uh, customer service managers, right? Like basically, the front end manager, uh, she's basically working the cashier like constantly. She's the only one there to ring me up like half the time I go. Um, it's crazy, man. Oh, actually, that's a, that's a bad way of doing it, right? <laughs> do we, like, put it, like, somewhere else in order to make that work? How about we how about we do this instead? We'll just jut it right off of this. And we'll just have it waltz right on by. <laughs> no, no crazy bridges or anything. Nothing silly. Just good old-fashioned. Let me see. Yeah, we can go down. And this water's gonna be hot, so I don't think I want it to go into the room. So, actually, we'll just go straight across, and then we will go down. I can reach all that, I think. Having worked at Target and Fry's, Fry's feels like I'm a fucking caveman. Target is a very smart system for inventory management. Oh, man. This will help get a little bit more, uh, a little bit more hydrogen in the room. Although we're doing a stellar job just using this thing. But yeah, this will be great just to get some of this hydrogen in the room. I guess we don't need this thing anymore, so we'll go and deconstruct that as well. I do, I do feel like something should go in its place. Meh. Leaving it open for now just to get a nice, you know, pillow going, or a nice fill, and then we're going to seal it all off. Go and get rid of this. Yeah, it's like a micro center or a circuit city or a copy of say. <laughs> Let me just say a bunch of things that are actually closed except for micro center. <laughs> Fries is like copy of say closed. <laughs> it's like the uh, Fries is like, uh, like a Best Buy kind of actually. There you go. It's kind of like a Best Buy. Go, 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 go. Faster. Best Buy and Radio Shack had a default child. That's sad, but also, yes. Also, yes. All right, so now this thing's working. Now, we're not going to get really anything out of this. It's going to go in at, what, 157 degrees? It's probably going to come out at 157, 117 degrees. So already, already... Look at that. Already. It's just dropping. It's dropping it, man. So good. So good. 